Hey, I'm Jim Flanagan, and this is Ike. Um, we're the ushers, so I guess we're here to usher in the wedding video. Yeah, super excited about it. Really excited. Yeah. Um, this is just a little video that the bridal party made. Um, we just figured we'd do something different because slideshows are so boring. You know, sorry if you had one at your wedding. Um, <laughs> but, I mean, no one wants to hear, like, a 311 song with pictures of Vince and Zeke Cavaricis followed by, you know. Oshkosh Bagash. Oshkosh Bagash, yeah. yeah. <laughs> followed by some Sheryl Crow showing Tiffany growing yeah. up and then the Jerry Maguire theme song showing the two of them and their lives together. Yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, here is party. Vince and Tiffany's bridal party video. Enjoy. Show me that smile, oh, okay. show me that smile. Don't waste another minute on your crying. We're nowhere near the end. We're nowhere near the best. He's ready to begin. Oh, as long as we got each other, we got the world spinning light in our hands, baby. You and me, we gotta be. So why am I in the wedding party? I think it's totally a courtesy invite. They were in my wedding in March, so they just really felt obligated to ask me to stand up in theirs. By default, I had Vince be my best man, so I guess I have to be his. There's probably 50 other guys Vince would like in here, but since uh, I'm Tiff's brother, uh, he's kind of pigeonholed. Wait, wedding party? I thought this was one of those things that just stayed in Vegas. I'm in the wedding party because I was promised free booze. Tiffany and I have known each other for a long time and she has become a sister to me. Because there wouldn't be a wedding without me. Because Vince loves me. Probably because a few people said no. I uh, really think Vince did this because he knows how much I hate walking or physical activity at all. So he decided to make me an usher. Because it is so much cooler to be sitting at the head table. I don't want to be sitting out there at a round table awkwardly facing somebody that I don't really know that well, forced into a two hour intimate dinner setting where I'm not even going to eat half the food, forced conversation with somebody I really don't like, but I have to pretend like I like him for that night. I am sitting at a flat table. Gosh, how long have they been dating? I'd say a total of four years. No, five years. Four years? I think four years. Six years? They've been in love for between four and six years. Two years, three months, seven days, 14 hours and 23, no, 24 seconds. Vince and Tiffany have been on and off for a couple years now. Uh, you know, I mean, one time they really went on and off. We subtracting the part in the middle that no one talks about? I mean, collectively, probably what, three, four years? 17 years. Today. <laughs> there we go. Vince and I have been dating for on and off for four years. Actually, I shouldn't say that. Vince and I have been dating for on and off for four years. <laughs> Where was their first kiss? Uh, my guess is on Vince's big nose. I didn't even know they did that stuff on the neck. <laughs> um, on their first date. <laughs> I'm guessing he probably took her to a nice restaurant, so somewhere back table of a Wendy's would be my guess. I'd say in a car. Uh, 30 minutes ago? They first kissed, I believe, it was in Naperville on Riverwalk and Vince actually 
uh, gave a dollar to a homeless guy that was really hungry at the time. It was at Tiffany's house. We played a game of speed. And every time you lost, you'd have to take a shot. Well, at one point he said, If I lost, I would have to take a shot. And if Tiffany lost, she would have to kiss me. So, of course I won. Tiffany tried as hard as she possibly could and ended up beating me. So, he didn't get a kiss, but I still gave it to him. So. <laughs> Who wears the pants in the relationship? Tiffany, hands down. Oh, Tiffany definitely wears the pants in the relationship. Totally Tiffany. I'd be Tiffany. Even though they're the same size. Um, they both wear very skinny pants. Senorita Mula tiene los pantalones. You know, I'm not in their pants, um, but from my experience on what I see from the outside, uh, it would definitely be Tiffany. Come on. She wears my pants. She wore my pants until she wore Vince's. Uh, Vince is kind of a skirt, so I'd say Tiff. I am pretty confident everybody in this video said Tiffany wears the pants and I wear the skirt. Vince wears the pants. Are you serious? Yeah. Every other person has said the complete opposite. I can't, I can't say that. I gotta say he wears the pants. Oh, yeah, you do. <laughs> <laughs> Who wears the pants in the relationship? Vince wears the pants in the relationship. <laughs> <laughs> Who wears the pants in the relationship? You mean these? Oh yeah, it's him. It's him. Vince and Tiffany belong together because they're perfect for each other. I'm just kidding. It's because Randy's already married. <laughs> Vince and Tiffany belong together because nobody else wants them anymore. <laughs> Anyone who's spent any amount of time with them knows that there is a real love and mutual adoration there and they are happier together. Vince and Tiffany belong together because I don't know of any other person that would put up with Vince's shit other than Tiffany. Or, I shouldn't say shit, I said shit. Or, I think that they are an amazing couple together and they're definitely uh, a, a power couple that'll take on the world. They make each other happy and Vince does yard work with his shirt off. Is that still okay? <laughs> <laughs> because Tiff can actually make Vince laugh, like the real laugh. And Vince can make Tiff do that weird cackle laugh that she does <laughs> with the weird snort and the, the <gasps> that she does that's really loud and, and obnoxious. Um. Vinny Boom Boom and I belong together because we truly love each other. We have so much in common and uh, we, we're perfect for each other. I can't imagine my life without anybody else, so. We belong together for the baby. Eric and Bob will be having their child in just a couple of months, and we need to be an aunt and an uncle for that child. What were you thinking? Vince and Stephanie belong together because they belong to the night. They belong to each other. They belong, they belong, they belong together. I don't know that song. Yes, you do. I really don't. They belong to the night. They belong to each other. Ooh, we belong. Na, 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 na. And what's for another? Because they belong to the night. They belong to each other. They belong. They belong to the night. They belong to each other. We belong.
<laughs> How about a big round of applause for the bridal party? And uh, yeah, oh, yeah, they look good. Yeah. They look good where they're sitting. You and, don't look uh, so bad yourself. I don't. And uh, one more time for your ushers, um, Chris, <laughs> I, I course and Jim Flanagan, um, yeah. buy them a drink yeah. if they're still standing. Yes, and when the bar doesn't have it open anymore, so we don't want to, you know. But, yeah, okay. we'll see you there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, anyway, uh, we hope you enjoyed the video. We hope it was worth all the work we put into it. And a um, uh, special shout out and thank you to Joe Martin for putting this whole thing together. Yeah. Um, and, uh, you know, congratulations to Vince and Tiffany. Um, all that stuff that we're going to be hearing about them all night. We yep. hope you're together for a long time and very happy. And uh, we oh, love you guys. Yeah. And yeah, we do love them. And mm -hmm. we should probably thank Chris Bilkington for doing our makeup this evening. We should thank Chris Bilkington thank you, for Chris. doing our makeup this evening. I think he did good on you. you he did a nice job. You don't really need too much. Makeup, I don't. I don't. I use yeah. a bit of bronzer. Yes. That'd be all. Yeah. Um, but we really want to thank everyone uh, for being here tonight and um, enjoy the next part of the evening. Yeah. Which is... What's this going to be before or after? No clue. About to happen. Yes. That's what it is. About to happen. And uh, enjoy the next part of the evening. Thank you guys very much. Thank you very much, too.